Very good afternoon to all of you. Thanks for joining us here on Mirror Now. I am Afrida Rehman Ali. Let's begin with the big breaking news coming in. In a miraculous incident, 40 workers in Bengaluru had a narrow escape when the building that they were inside collapsed in front of them. Fire department officials rushed to the spot just minutes before the building collapsed and evacuated all those inside. Neha Hibale joining us on the phone line with more inputs. Yes, Neha, over to you for the latest on this. What is the situation on ground? Well, Afrida, this was, you know, in fact, a very narrow escape. We understand for about 40 of the residents of this building, and at the time of the collapse, there were about 10 people inside is what we pick up. Uh, the fire department, in fact, you know, just very swiftly managed to send their teams there, evacuate these people just about five minutes before the collapse of this building. We understand that for almost about three years now, Afrida, the locals or the neighbors of, uh, you know, building had been warning that this building, you know, did have, in fact, a tilt that was visible and, uh, you know, that, that it was on the verge of... It was a very old building that we're actually looking at over here. But uh, thankfully, there have not been any casualties, no injuries, and quick work by the fire force uh, team over here also that has you know, managed to sort of evacuate all of these people over here in time. As of now, Afrida, the situation on ground remains that the building has, of course, collapsed. Efforts are on to clear all of the debris, but uh, no injuries and uh, no casualties, more importantly. And uh, that, that, of course, is, you know, something that's important. But um, on the larger uh, perspective of things, Afrida, it has been, in fact, you know, almost about a good six years now since the BBMP actually, or even the fire department for that matter, you know, conducted a fire audit is what we understand since this building was a ground plus three of, you know, since, of course, it does not really fall under the high-rise buildings, there's got to be a mechanism is what uh, police have also, you know, been saying now to actually audit the low-rise buildings also. Right. Thanks, Neha, for joining us with the latest update.